Hello, Lucan. I'd like to practice with the training dummy. Excellent. Yeah, That'd sure. be brilliant. Wonderful. I'll set things up. Remember to cast all the spell combinations before the... If you need to stop practicing before you finish all of them, let me know. I take to face you in a duel. Thanks, Lucan. You've been a great help. Oh, stop. Don't make me blur. Seriously, well done. Train. Plus, you'll be even more formidable in cross Hello, Lucan. Big match today. Ready for a shot at glory? I certainly am. Brilliant. Are you dealing with a... I'll go it alone. We can make this a real victory. That's the spirit. For him alone? Yes, I'm ready now. I'm ready now. Akio. Levioso. Incendio. Protego. 
Mostly luck, that's all. Please, you wouldn't have got this far on luck alone. Now, to the victor goes the prize! And so it is my great honor to present you Thank you. You earned it! You are a duelist to be reckoned with. Now that we've definitively crowned the tournament winner, I suppose I should get back to my schoolwork. Wonder how my herbology plants are doing. I haven't tended them in ages. Lost to a new student? Hmm, I didn't see that coming. The best duelist won, I suppose. You can't be beat, can you? The duelist? Like, it was one day before. Shame it's over. I was just getting started. How do I do that? How inconvenient travel was before I invented blue powder. Good morning, Professor Garlic. How wonderful it is to see you again, Lenora dear. Oh, here. You'll need these for today's class. Uh, um, uh, a little treat for your auntie. Welcome the newest rose in our garden. We do look forward to growing together. How thrilling it is to have everyone back together again. This year will be filled with enchantment and excitement, but the most important thing cultivated in herbology is knowledge. The prudent herbologist is no more afraid of the venomous tentacula than the bouncing bowl. Then, today we will be acquainting ourselves with the mellifluous tuber known as the Mandrake root. Accio. Let's see if we can't make our fibrous friends a bit more comfortable, shall we? First, let's protect our ears. Hmm. 
Now, everyone, grip their mandrake by the tendrils and give it a firm tug. I came down here for that class. It was like two minutes long. Okay. Next class. Okay. Another class. I need to have a brief word with our new student. I wonder if the not class. Yes, Professor. Firstly, well done with your mandrake. They can be rather difficult to get a grasp of. Actually, I enjoyed it. I couldn't help but catch your enthusiasm. How kind of you. It seems you're already taking to herbology like a mandrake to fresh soil. Now, as I mentioned, next we'll be planting dittany. Let us find you some seeds. I already have some, Professor. Pick them up in Hogsmeade. You've visited the Magic Neep. Wonderful. A prepared student is bound to bloom. I've arranged for you to have your own potting table here in the classroom. It wasn't easy to spare one on such late notice. Plant the seeds there now, and you can return to harvest them later. Even with soil, sunlight, and a bit of magic, they will take time to grow. Let's see how to balance my star thistle arrangement. Mithra's fancy. Vitamin's restorative properties make it a vital ingredient in the Wigan Mountain, as you all should know from Professor Sharp's class. Done. Once it can be harvested, your destiny will be ready to use in Wigan. Now, what say we branch out? Introduce you to a different sort of flora, the Chinese chomping cabbage. You'll find that some plants are better suited to uses outside of a cauldron. The cabbages do get testy without something to chew. Fortunately, I have a dummy for them to gnaw on. Dear, dear, and let them have a good chomping. Yes, Professor. They're in the other greenhouse. It's just at the end of the footbridge leading out of this room. Your classmate, Mr. Pruitt, has kindly offered to accompany you. Come back and see me when you're finished. Oh, and mind your fingers. They do bite. What should I be doing right now? I'd like you to get some hands-on exp... They're in the greenhouse, just across the foot... The best time to plant a seed is last season. The second best time is now. I should think Professor Garlic would be more careful with her mandrakes. Did you know that you can use the mandrake to defend yourself? Why, very idea. Oh, okay. Nice work in defense against Rebellion. the Rebellion. Excuse me. Your duel with Sebastian. And he's good. Huh. Thinks he's really good. But you outright slaughtered him. It was brilliant. Oh. Well. Thank you. I nearly put Sebastian in his place myself. I mean, I would have if Hecate hadn't stopped me. Didn't she stop that dragon skull from crushing you? Typical Slytherin trick, dropping a dragon skull on someone during a fight. We Gryffindors fight with honor. And, uh, Ravenclaws too. Here we Rebellion. are. Rebellion. Home of the Chinese chomping cabbage. Go on, grab a few of those cabbages. Just, now, see that dummy? Just toss the cabbages at it, and they'll do the rest. Now, 
gnomes on. <laughs> Mum planted some in her garden last year to keep the gnomes out. I did save her the dean home, but they left her honking daffodils in tatters. Vicious little bastards, aren't they? My kind of plants. Not like stupid booba tubers and bouncing bulbs. The kind of plants that just have your back in a fight. I'm not saying you can't go it alone, but... Well, imagine that wasn't a dummy. I suppose they could prove useful outside of the greenhouse. Nothing wrong with a bit of backup, even if it is from a cabbage. It's chaos out there. Trolls and hogsmeade and such. You can't be above throwing a cruciferous vegetable if necessary. Dogweed and Death Camp has more of them, if you're keen. Other plants too. Way. Ones your parents wouldn't plant in the garden. You get the idea. Anyway, <sighs> we uh, probably ought to head back to class. Ugh, Take your time. I'll see you back in class. Rebellion. Reminder as to why we should always wear our dragon hide gloves. I shall end our lesson here. Terribly sorry, Mr. Clopton. I tended to the Chinese chomping cabbages, Professor. Remarkable plants, aren't they? I hope they weren't too much trouble. Oh, don't see any bite marks or missing digits. And good, as you do seem to be quite green fingered. Oh, I'm eager to see your skill in the soil continue to blossom. Magical plants have so much to offer. I'm eager to learn more. I'm glad. Herbology is a bounteous subject. Tend to your garden, and it will tend to you. Huh. Well, I suppose that's everything. Do come by for a chat sometime. I so enjoy checking in with my new students. Oh, those mandrakes are really relishing their new pots.
Fat lady? So. You stay in your portrait, not stay in mine. I'm not in a portrait. Apparently I can't fucking go there. Rebellion. Revelio. Yes, I mean, shut up. Enough! Here, perhaps you'll find sweeping the courtyard more productive. Reading can be a brutal call. Not to fly. Okay. That is what I said, and let this be a lesson to all of you. Off limits means off limits. Ugh, feel like a muggle. I got a look at one of them, saw something about the Cruciatus curse. I did. Oh, shut up. Yeah, that's with me. Good job. I haven't heard any nasty comments lately. Not since. Could you remind me how the Dedalian key. When you spot or hear a flying key. I hope you follow some. If you open a cabinet, I'd love. Who told you? I found some fucking oh. house there. Rebellion. Oh, what's the thing? There it is. Lumos. Lumos. Rebellion. 
Revelio. Rebellion. Incendio. Revelio. Solar protection goggles. Also known as motherfucking sunglasses. Okay. Where are we at here? Rebellion. Duncan owes his reputation to you. Who 
Solutions is one of the most challenging and hazardous subjects taught at this school. As fifth years, you will be required to reach new heights of both discipline and intellect. You will begin this term by brewing a Wigan Weld Potion. Mr. Takar, can you tell us why this particular potion might come in handy? Yes, Professor Sharp. The Wigan Weld Potion can be used to sterilize and even heal a variety of injuries. It can heal some injuries, but not all. Point for Ravenclaw. Before today's class is completed, each of you will have brewed a Wigan Weld Potion of your own. You never know when you might need it. Please begin. You gonna teach me how? Use a strong, even motion when crushing your ingredients. Please be meticulous when adding powder to your potions. One errant sneeze could be disastrous. I see most of you have not forgotten how to stir. Hmm. Not an easy potion to brew. Well done. And from what I hear of your recent exploits in Hogsmeade, you'd also do well to practice brewing the defensive Edurus potion. Professor Weasley had you acquire the recipe from Jay Pippins, correct? Yes, sir. Good. For the moment, you can find the ingredients you need in my office. But in the future, you'll be expected to provide your own ingredients. Some can be harvested from the plants you grow in your herbology class, and rarer ones can be purchased. Others, however, may be harder to obtain, and will require you to be a bit more... resourceful. Come and see me when you've finished brewing, and we'll see if it was skill or luck the first time around. My parents considered keeping me home from school this year after the rumor. I hear Professor Sharp say that you have permission to go into his office. He did say that. He wants me to get more ingredients to brew another potion. Brilliant! You, my friend, have been presented with an extraordinary opportunity. I'm Gareth, by the way. Gareth Weasley. Bit of a prodigy with potions, if I do say so myself. Pleasure to meet you. Wait. Are you related to Professor Weasley? She's my aunt. Keeps too close an eye on me for comfort. Ugh. But she can't be everywhere. Listen, anyone with a troll-sized brain can brew an Adurus potion. I'm working on something that's certain to be spectacular. I'm just missing one tiny last ingredient that will add that extra spark. I suspect that's where I come in. You're as clever as I'd hoped. I simply need a single fooper feather. As you'll already be in Sharp's office with his permission, perhaps you could grab it for me. I don't know, Gareth. I don't want to get on Sharp's bad side. You won't. Fooper feathers aren't that valuable. Sharp won't even miss it. Well, I've enough to worry about collecting the ingredients he wants me to get. I'm afraid I can't help you. I understand. I'll sort something else out. Trying to give him to break the rules? Can we? Your potion should not be that. Look at that feather. I ain't see on that shit. Fuck you, bitch. Should the station's organized and should you chop the deadly or crush it? The wrong answer could result in the unfortunate loss of your eyebrows.
Oh man, I need some fucking heart pump juice. What the fuck is a heart pump? And now we add the mallow sweet. And that's odd. What's happening? Wait, it's not supposed to. Ah! Dragon dog. What happened? <laughs> well done, Garen. What now, Mr. Weasley? Sorry, Professor. That'll be points from Gryffindor again. So, girl. Professor Sharp said that Wiganweld potion can treat injuries. Hope I never need it. Don't fret if you run out of ingredients. I simply grow most of what I need. My Wiganweld potion's utter rubbish. Wish I could just replace it with one from J. Pippins. Professor Sharp must have learned a lot during his time as well. Remember. Fine job brewing your first Wiccan Weld potion. Thanks, sir. But there are many potions yet to learn. This is going to be a busy year. Wasn't expecting that literally to blow up in my face. It was rather brilliant, though. I'd better clean up. You should finish brewing your potion if you haven't already. I brewed an Edoras potion as you asked, Professor. Glad you managed to stay on task. Not every class is so... Eventful. I saw Mr. Weasley speaking with you earlier. He can be quite persuasive. Glad you managed to resist. You've done well today. I confess I was skeptical given the advanced nature of this class and the fact you're a new student. I'm glad I was able to meet your expectations. A rare occurrence. And you do well to remember that you're not a potions master quite yet. In addition to having a solid grasp of how to combine various ingredients, you should gain an understanding of the ingredients themselves. Pay particular attention in herbology. The plants you nurture there are often essential to the potions you brew here. Now, I recommend that you find a safe location in which to practice brewing. You cannot leave a hot cauldron simply anywhere. That'll be all. Okay, okay. That's it. I think each of us has had enough excitement for one day. Class is dismissed. We're gonna get some motherfucking horror juice. I was impressed that you were able to answer Professor Sharp's question about the Wigan Weld potion. Oh, thank you. That means a lot coming from a fellow Ravenclaw. And I've never seen anyone brew such a flawless Wigan Weld potion on their first try. Well done. I'm glad I was able to get it right the first time. You must simply have a knack for potion making. Some students seem so confounded by potion recipes, it's as if they're written in gobbledygook. A fascinating language, by the way. Neither here nor there, really, but I am a self-taught speaker. Merlin's beard, good conversation is the enemy of free time. I must return my book, Gateway to the Far Stars, before my next class. Speaking of stars, we yeah, in astronomy together. You'll love it. Professor Shaw is firm, but quite clever. See you soon, no doubt. Babe, if you want some of that of me, you know what I mean. It's over there, skirt. Rogue. What the, what the thing doing? What is it called again? Fucking hard mode. Now. What am I up to? I'm just like fucking going to my class and picking my plants. Here 
I come. We have everything Rebellion. a young student might need when it comes to potions. Have a good look at What can I do for you today? Wise decision. Thank you. A wise decision. Thank you. You're welcome. Rebellion. Revelio. Rebellion. What's that? Akio.
Revelio. Rebellion. It's almost like whispering I'm here. Why? Fuck this like whispering. I'm not in the school. There's no people around. Revelio. Rebellion. I need to fucking reload and see if this fixes. Rebellion.
Incendio. Incendio. You need some equipment to you there. Yeah. Lumos. Revelio. Rebellion. Hello. Can I help you? Oh, thank goodness. Yes. My name is Grace Pinch Smedley. Of the Bath Pinch Smedleys? Oh, I was hoping bath. someone would come along soon. I was about to defy my father's wishes and would never have forgiven myself. You see, I need to retrieve something from the bottom of the lake. Might you be the one to help me? Diving into the lake sounds like an adventure. Tell me more. Splendid. Precisely the response I'd hoped for. What do you need help retrieving? Wait, what's right here? Years ago, my grandfather, who fancied himself quite the astronomer, God, like set no sail from Hogsmeade Station for what was meant to be a quick stargazing cruise with my grandmother. They never returned. I'm so sorry. What happened to them? We can't be sure. We only know that neither they nor their boat made it back to shore. They were presumed drowned. Father was so distraught that he forbade our family from setting foot on or in the Black Lake ever again. A treasured family astrolabe vanished with them that night. If you could dive down and retrieve it, I may be able to bring my father some peace. You seem to think I might have heard of the Bath Pinch Smedleys. Why would I know your family? That's like asking why the sky is blue or grass is green. The Pinch Smedley name is synonymous with intellectual curiosity. We are known oh, okay. for our contributions to science and art. I'm surprised you haven't heard of us, frankly. But with all I plan to discover about the world around us, those that don't yet know the name certainly one day will. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. What exactly is an astrolabe? It's an astonishing ancient navigational tool. Essentially, a handheld model of the universe. It's mainly used for studying the stars, astronomical pursuits. But sadly, I'd imagine it's rusted beyond repair now. Still. Hmm. It sounds dangerous, especially for some. I understand. But I'd be forever grateful. I've cross-referenced the vessel's last alleged location against the lake's topography, depth charts, and tide schedule. My best guess is that it's just over there. 
about a furlong from the dock. It would be wonderful to have my grandfather's Just astrolabe there. back. Even point. I do hope you find the astrolabe. It would mean so much to our family. It sounds as if her astrolabe is just northeast of the dock. I should dive down and see. Alright. Yeah, I'm a good fucking swimmer. Shit, nigga. This must be where the pinch Smedley family astrolabe is. What? Find a fucking random shit down here. Oh, oh, okay, that's it. I should let Grace know that I found her family astrolabe. Like the worst skipping animation ever. Incendio. What's that water? Revelio. Lumos. I trust you didn't find the dive too terribly difficult. No. Hello, Grace. I followed your bearings on a dive in the Black Lake. Oh, how incredible! Did you find the astrolabe? I did. I hope it makes your father happy. It will. I can't wait to see his face. Thank you so much for doing this for me. And for my family. You do well to keep an eye out for more spots to dive. A diver of your caliber is certain to find all sorts of things down there. Thank you again. And I do hope you... You certainly have a knack for finding treasure.
Rebellion. I never thought Ramrock's... Pardon me, is everything all right? Hardly. I've just lost my business and almost my life. You'd best look at... I never thought it'd come to this. Be on your guard. Ramrock and his loyalists will spare no one. They attacked you. Oh, Ranrock has no patience for goblins who won't join him. While I too would like to see goblin kind treated by wizards as equals, bloodshed is not the answer. When I said as much, they turned on me, struck me till I nearly passed out. Took my carts, my belongings, even that which is most precious to me, my paintings. What, I was, what kind of question is that? I mean, at least I could be painting from other people. You mentioned that your paintings were taken. Are you a painter? I am. It's my calling, though most would think it an unusual path for a goblin. Most of my family work in metal, or associated with Gringotts. I'd wager my finest brush that Ramrock's lot have no appreciation for any of my work, and it'll be tossed aside for kindling. Without my cart to my livelihood, who knows when I'll be able to paint again. Has Ramrock's lot ever attacked you like this before? They've been taunting and threatening me for a while now. They've always believed that violence is the only way to get what they want. Things have taken a much darker turn of late. Ramrock is getting more powerful, and his loyalists know it. I feel untouchable. Ramrock assumed that all goblins would agree to follow him. But he was wrong. Many of us would like a diplomatic end to the discord with wizard kind. I'm sorry this happened to you. That is very kind of you, but I think they took them to their camp southwest of here, just past some ruins. Too dangerous to try and retrieve them. I did enchant the carts to return to me if I... Eh, slim though the chances may be. I'm holding out. It was nice meeting you. <laughs> I wish it had been under better circumstances. Revelio. Seems a pleasant enough little place. After what Ranrock did to that goblin banker at Gringotts, I shouldn't be surprised at what happened to Arn. Hello, sir. What do you sell here? Hello. I'm Jalal Semi, and this is my book. Any whispers going about the town? There's a thief on the loose by the name of Katrin Haggerty. She's an ash rinder. She's stealing everything that's not nailed down, and people have had enough. Katrin's hiding in a camp just southwest of town. What do you have for sale? What can I help you with today? I'll have no trouble selling this. Thank you. Yes, a wonderful choice. Hope to see you again sometime. Okay. Revelio.
Revelio. Quick K connected and enter channel. You've won less follower run, Revelio. Looks as if there's more than one way to enter. Let 
shield. Quite something. Now, free arms cards. Rebellion. Rebellion. Quite an enchantment. The carts are returning to arm. Rebellion. Rebellion. Incendium. Accio. Rebellion. Incendio.
How do I get rid of these fucking whispers?